Why have we got no match highlights for you this week? Because there were no matches, that's why, and this is why there were no matches. However, it does give us a chance to have a look at what's going to happen next weekend when the Scottish teams go into the British and Irish Cup. Air, Curry and Melrose all into the cross-border adventure. Last season, Air were the only one of the three who were in the British and Irish Cup. And when they took on Birmingham Solihull Bees at Millbrae, ha <laughs> ha, they scored a couple of cracking tries. Last year, Heriots were Scotland's other club representatives and they came up against Neath at Golden Acre. And, well, it was a pretty sore first half for them as they went four tries behind. <laughs> Scottish clubs won't be encountering Neath this season. They're in Pool C, avoiding Curry and Ayr and Melrose. Looking at this, probably just as well. And in their opening match of the British and Irish Cup this weekend, Air will meet Pontypridd. When the two clashed at Millbrae last season, we ended up with an absolute cracker of a game. It went right to the final minute, Air 21 points to 15 ahead. And this try by Christian Buller pulled Pontypridd back to within a point. They still needed the kick to go over to win the game. And off the post, what a way to win a match. You can see what it meant to the boys from Pontypridd. It's going to be some game when the pair of them meet down in Wales this weekend. So that's here to play Pontypridd. And Melrose, well, they'll be up against Munster at the Green Yards. And when Aaron Melrose met at Melbury earlier in the season, both sides showed that they were capable of some terrific rugby. Scotland's third representatives in the British and Irish Cup and they showed when they came up against Burham Muir earlier in the season that they too could play some smashing rugby and they'll be hoping to reproduce this sort of form when they take on the Cornish Pirates at Maleny Park this weekend.
So there we are. We wish Curry, Air, and Melrose all the very best for this weekend. Hopefully this will all have cleared up by then. If it hasn't, well, I'm sure they'll make the best of it anyway. This is Ron Evans for Scottish Rugby Television in the snow. Thank <laughs> you.